What you have to realize is that both iPhone and um, Google Drive is spyware. Without us knowing what permissions were given away, they're actually spying on you and that information has been sold to third parties without our knowing. What it means is that we are a commodity. We have been treated as a commodity and that can have an impact on surveillance capitalism in regards to your health, in regards to a job you might like to get hold of. So basically speaking, of developing a database in order to um, preempt your likes, dislikes, your jobs, your friends, and they're just more or less creating a map of your personal life and it has a huge impact on us. So if you go to something like, say, Graphene OS is what's called a hardened operating system, or de-Googled, and uh, has no dependencies on iTunes or Google Drive. And you can get your apps, which are far more efficient than the Google Drive uh, apps because they all have all these dependencies and who knows what other deals they may be behind the scenes. F-Droid is based on open software or free software principles which is transparent and you have a closer relationship with the developer rather than the corporation. There's a new layer one called Zaino, Z-A-N-O. It's a blockchain based on autonomy and privacy. It's what we don't realize in a surveillance based economy when they talk about tokenization is that your house will be tokenized by a third party. Now you've got a whole folder of all the legalities. Well, that's all been digitalized. Who holds custody? Not you.